talk here in Los Angeles, I now wish to, <coughs> this is going to shock the two of you, conduct a, na a national inquest into something that occurred in uh, Los Angeles in the summer. <coughs> Let me set the scene for the public. I think you'll remember the shocking scene. <laughs> Anne was in Disneyland. She was walking about asking the customers and spectators at Disneyland, were they enjoying themselves? She walked along the crowd, little suspecting what she was about to meet. Watch this. Any, any more people here? Want to well, say I, I like to say oh, Good morning. 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 Good Good morning. 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 Good Out, won't you? Yes, I will. You, you wouldn't like to just repeat it, would uh, you? Well, yes, well, there is Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Patrick Duffy, you have compromised the lady's honour. Explain yourself. The cheek of the woman. She asked for I another know, one. There was, there was just something that she was standing there and you just went like this. <laughs> <laughs> Freeze frame. Oh. There was nothing left to do. There's I'm helpless in these situations, actually. There are millions of people, especially women, <laughs> throughout the last <laughs> week. <laughs> Very jealous of me. You'll never be sure now, dude. Oh, that's lovely. Actually, you'll probably be wondering what's happened to Nick as well. Because, I don't uh, care about Nick, actually. <laughs> 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 Let me tell you anyway. Oh, all right. No, I was explaining to Patrick a bit earlier that uh, Nick's back isn't very good at the moment. That's why he right. can't be here this morning. Right. His front's not so hot either. But that's <laughs> oh, sorry, Nick, I really do like it. It's just that, you know. Absolutely, mm -hmm. yes. Mm. <laughs> uh, there's a more serious side to you, though, isn't there? There is. Is there? Yes, because yeah. we read about th that you're um, a Buddhist. Yes. And you yes. do take life very seriously, but doesn't it stop oh. your, your giggling and laughing? Well, it doesn't stop me from having fun. It, I, actually, I think it allows me to have more fun because I, I, I feel a serious responsibility not just to practice Buddhism, but for the tenets which are... The only reason Buddhism exists is to create a peaceful situation in the world. And as, you know, the, the news of the last two hours indicates, uh, it, we're in desperate need of that. And so I feel very seriously about that. But I also, by the practice, have, have a life condition or a feeling inside of great confidence and hope and, and lightness. And, and so it, the two go together very well. There's a story that when you were a young actor, I think you were just married, and you, probably your, your first baby was very young. Yeah. And uh, you were very struggling. And you used to go in and you used to nag people every day and say, why aren't I more successful? Sure. What's happening? Why am I a failure? That's right. And it was something that one of your leaders one of, said. One of my leaders me. said, told me, it was very funny, because I went in every day almost every day to, I said, gee, you know, I had a beautiful son, I had a wonderful, loving wife, everything was going well that way, but my career was absolutely zero. Mm -hmm. And when I went in and talked to him, finally he said, you know, I'm so tired of you coming in here all the time. Because he, he had a great deal of confidence. I had some, but not to the extent he did in the inevitability of this practice producing results. And he said, I don't want to talk to you anymore. He says, I'm really sick of seeing you around, so why don't you go away and you practice Buddhism for 10 years, and you come back, and if you have anything to complain about, that's when I'll talk to you. So it's been a little over 10 years now, and I quite honestly have to say I have very little to complain have about. Have you been back to see him? Oh, yeah. I talk to him a lot now, but he's glad to see me, <laughs> because I'm not complaining. Absolutely. Yeah. All right, now, look, you're, you're shooting this film. Yes. What are talking about? When are we going to Strong see it? Medicine. I am not sure, and I should have gotten that information before. I, I know it won't be till the mid of next year, or, or at least the beginning of next year. Well, I'm sure it won't creep up on us without knowing. Will, oh, you no. will you come back when you're sort of coming over here to tell us all about will it? Will you be here? Yes. Will Nick? Yes. <laughs> well, then it's a debatable. Well, Mike, come on. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be yeah. Here. No, I, I would very much like to because it will be here on, you know, on television. And if I have the opportunity, I would like to come back. Okay. Well, we'll invite you, you back. There's an open invitation. Thank, Thank you very you. much for coming in today. Have a good day's filming. Thank you. Do I get another kiss? Yeah, but we'll do a real one later. Okay. Yeah, we'll take a break first. <laughs>